guys, welcome back to the channel, it's Winter Helm Games, and we're back with another episode of GTA 5. Left off with Michael, fine to go up to the, the bureau, see what was happening. He got in contact with his former so his associate, um, and now he's basically back doing stuff for them. So I've stopped out here to do this mission with um, your guy again, his friend, or associate, whatever we want to call him. And then there's another mission up there. And then I can see if um, Franklin or Trevor have anything new. But we'll see how this goes. So. I thought I would give him something different to wear. Because he was just wearing the t-shirt and that there. Until he gets home. Um, at some point then I can always give him suited and booted again. Alright. Where is the, um, is it up top? Hmm. Not in here, is it? Wouldn't think so. No. Alright. Don't know if I have to go up or not. Maybe I do have to go up. I might have to go up. Let me see. I might have to go up to the next level. Let's go and have a nosy. You ain't worth nothing. Are you okay? Fine wood. That's what I said the other day in the stream or the other week. Um, when I was doing uh, Twitch streaming for Farming Simulator. The uh, map we were on was called... Um, it was a New Jersey map. It was East Fineland. New Jersey. I kept saying East, East uh, Vinewood. <laughs> like, no, that's not it, that's uh, GTA. <laughs> there. So, this must be... Must be it. I haven't said that. Oh, there we are. I was going to say, it's right by the the road. There we are. FIB. Go to Dave. Let's see what Dave has to say. This nice. You didn't tell me we were double dating. Sorry, guys. <laughs> this barn hunk of love is all mine. <laughs> Brilliant. Steve Haynes, amigo, but you probably knew that already. Sorry, your name tag must have fallen off. Love it. I gotta remember to write that down and to shoot you in your head, you annoying dick. <laughs> Andreas, taking notes. This stuff. Whoa. Pure magic. They should put it on my show. Have you seen my show? You mean how to dress like a salesman on a cheap golf weekend at a third-rate country club? <laughs> so, well done with our uh, our friend, Mr. K. My pleasure. Uh, I love helping our government wage war, especially with itself. But you made a mistake. Did I, Cupcake? Why don't you keep your fucking voice down before I close your fucking windpipe? <laughs> the joke stopped now, pal. You will show me and my team some respect. Maybe you could define team for me. Is that just the three of you? Or the greater FIB? Or the entire government? Because I'm tempted to argue that thus far, we haven't shown a lot of your colleagues a whole lot of respect. 
Then why don't you start with me, genius? You got it, pal. Yeah, because you're shooting other agents, agency workers, agents and cops and all sorts. Just to keep a few secrets. Mr. K at the local agency station. I just dealt with that guy. The agency is stepping up to questioning because of your moronic antics down at the coroner's office. We need to get him out of there before he blabs. Blabs. Agent Norton said. Then I guess you getting involved with a clapped out old agent who's been living off of past glories was your first mistake. You are my boy now, amigo. My career depends on this. Hmm. And that's very important to me. So seeing as we're all boys now, that makes it important to you. He doesn't care. No, run along, kids. <laughs> he doesn't seem to care. See, there you go, Dave. You can teach an old dog new tricks. Come on. The Bureau owns a lot out in East L.S. Covington Supplies off El Rancho. Can you take us there? Yeah, sure. Sounds nice and secluded. Kind of place you'd run an off-the-books operation, huh? So what? So I bet federal ain't on the deed. That's so. And we all like our federal government open and transparent. Except when closed and opaque suits you better. Hey, I'm just a puppet. You're the one pulling the strings. That's a nice, nice set of wheels, but then he is an agent. He has plenty of money. It's his car, like, but then you imagine he would be driving it. I need you to make a couple of calls. Get some people on board. First guy is Franklin Clinton. Hey, I barely know that kid. He's fixing up my car. Call him, or we'll send some G-men to his aunt's house. Okay. Okay. Mike, this ain't the best time. I'm kind of busy. Hey, sorry about that. Listen, you know that thing we talked about night. before? It's Up or dying? I need you to come to a lot off El Rancho. Not far mm -hmm. from where we met before. I think it's this way. Cool. I think. Anyway. But all the ones going around to the right or the left, so. Oh, you're crazy. I ain't calling him. I thought you might say that. So we had him picked up. That's a dumb move, Dave. Real fucking dumb. Just worry about the plan, okay? Getting Mr. K out of the <laughs> IAA station. Clinton is going to be positioned across the street. Trevor is funny. I have to say, Trevor is my favorite. He's funny. Well down, make the extraction. <laughs> and I'm the best guy you got for this. With you, we've got good leverage. Great. And you brought Trevor in. We're telling him I'm all cozy with the F5B. You'll need discreet support. We'll maintain control of the situation. Discreet? Control? Yeah, good luck controlling discreet Trevor. Now, I wonder how controllable <laughs> and discreet he'll be when he sees the guy who killed me and put Brad in jail. Maybe I'll hang back. Yeah. That yeah. Be a good idea. <laughs> okay, so this is going to be interesting. Yeah. You know what? You better keep a low profile. Yeah, I think I will. See you later. Who's that cagey motherfucker, huh? <laughs> no, I, it's another cagey motherfucker, all right? Not you. Hey, T, enough with the faux political bullshit. <sighs> Franklin, come on, you better take off. Really? Shit, I'm good. I ain't bailed. Whoa. What, am I detecting some, uh, some sort of, uh, son I never had bullshit here, Mikey, huh? Hey, listen, if you want to replace some father figure, you can do a lot better than this fat snake, all right? This fucker would eat his own kids. Like I said, Franklin, deranged. Yeah, and best friend. <laughs> exactly. That's Trevor, my best friend. That's Franklin, the son I always wanted. <sighs> all right, guys, listen, this is the shot. I'm gonna do all the heavy lifting on this job, okay? Trevor, all I need you to do is fly me to the target. Franklin, you're gonna cover me from across the street. We're gonna make these assholes happy, and we're gonna walk away from this thing clean. Got it? I got gotcha. you. All right. And we do this, and they help us bring Brad, right? Yeah. 
We'll talk about Brad later. All right, I gotta change. You better grab a head start. Nice to meet you, homie. Mm. Yeah, whatever. There we are. First introductions for Trevor and Franklin. Okay, stay frosty. <laughs> the access point is on the west side of the tower. Get us in position so I can repel down. Die, we're gonna die, we're gonna die. Jeez. That's <laughs> oh, fuck when you wreck the fucking thing. Take <laughs> go down low, but then that's too low. So it's repelled down the side. Okay. from the target. to repel. Right. Okay. Like, what the hell? <laughs> I don't know how far I'm going down, though. Thank you. 
up here. Get me the station chief! I'm not finished with Mr. K! 36 flow. I got you. We are not... There's another shooter! What's happening? Anyone else there? There is. There's someone there. Shit. Come on, let's go, let's go. That was a. Uh, it landed there, huh? Oh shit. Yes. Switched between all three of them. Ha <laughs> very good. That was good. They're dying. Talk to you. You saved me. Thank you. Thank you. Don't mention it. <laughs> the Bureau, the FIB, they will make everything okay. I'm sure. Don't worry, they'll look after you. The things they'll make sure it's a nice funeral. <laughs> on this Had sie es top and took. <laughs> In bed with the bureau and a new running buddy. Yeah, he's more of a protege. Yeah, what? You gonna teach him to be old before his time? Mm. Never grow up. That seems like a good kid. Michael, I look at Ooh, there we are. a new city, new set of problems, but the idiots, ah, they stay the same. Yep, I guess. All right, Jerry, I'll see you later. Oh, you better believe it, buddy. I've been forgetting to uh, put some decorations up. I'll have to do that tomorrow if I can. <laughs> There's 
time enough, I suppose, isn't there? And some people are probably thinking, too early still for Christmas decorations. Oh well. I normally put them up the first weekend or so. You contact Steve. Now let's get him home. It's a mission with Franklin. But I'll get him to go home first, will I? I suppose Franklin's on the way. Maybe we'll just save. I haven't said I think that's a mission for Franklin, so yeah. As far as I think so. I can't remember what way it works. It's on the way, I'll double check, but I'm pretty sure that's happened before. We're we'll gonna have to be Franklin for that mission. But we'll have a check. Say so it's on the way. And then if not, we'll go up to the house. And see what's happening up there. So. Let's see. Where? Not his car, he doesn't have to worry about it. Return as Franklin or Trevor to start this mission? Okay. There we are. Okay, well, I can bring him up home first, then come back as... Maybe Trevor, who knows? At least we know. So, let's get up to the house. Um, it's a bit longer away, but we will see you up there. Oh yeah. Radio. We are here. Let's see what the, this mission is. I lost my door there. <laughs> Okay. Oh, 
day or two later. What is wrong with you smoking in my house? You know, ever since that psychotic pal of yours turned up, you've turned into an even bigger asshole. Thank you. <sighs> Your support in my difficult times means the world to me. I've supported you. I left everything to come here with you, and still that crazy bastard turns up. I'll handle it. How? I don't know. Oh, you know what? Just keep him away from me and the children, you low-life, whoremongering asswipe. Did someone say yoga? No, I think she said whoremongering asswipe. Hello, Fabian, darling. <laughs> Namaste, Amanda. Are we ready to practice? Yes. Oh, yes. She's very centered. A regular you oasis see what I of peace and tranquility. A girl this with one. anger issues and worse friends. No you wonder I'm so upset. You too. Please. Namaste. We practice. Miguel, join us, please. No, please, no. No, no. I was like, uh, it might actually help him. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> She's like, if you can make me as happy and mellow as my wife, it'll be a job well fucking done. <laughs> All on our own journeys, Miguel. Yeah, no doubts. Why is she driving a tank on hers? <laughs> Perhaps to deal with your hostility, Michael. Now here is good. We have the sun and the moribunda. The asshole. Now we begin and put the asshole to the asshole. earth. Yes, <laughs> we begin each sequence. Atasana. Look at his face. Like, <laughs> <Or, laughs> we must put the asshole to the ground. <laughs> Mouth and anus are perfectly in line. Show him, Amanda. One, two, three. It is perfect. Now, Michael. This is going to be interesting. We have. Later you will cry like a baby. Yeah, right. His chakras are completely blocked. Don't worry about him. Some is a downward dog. I'm glad we have helped with your impotence, Mikael. What'd you say? Your sexual energies have been blocked for too long. Back into my pelvis. Back. What? Back, back. Yes, there you go. Uh, mm. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, <laughs> what? Hey, enough of that. We can't. Ah! Yoga is the answer, Mikhail. But what is the question? Uh, why am I such a moron? We are leaving and we are never coming back. Good! You are alone, you pathetic psychopath! Uh, fuck yeah. you. Whenever you run out of money, you'll soon be back. French fucking yogi! Ah. Jimmy! You still here? James! Fuck off! Oh yeah, fuck you. You know what? If there was a rape button, I'd be using it right now. Unless you're a faggot and you like that sort of shit. And I'm talking in your Nice TV. Did I pay for that? Yeah, you smashed the other one, didn't you? You just got him in the face. Alright, come on. I wanna go for a ride. I gotta meet a friend. Alright, so I'll go meet him with you. Come on, I want to get out of the house. I'm not going alone. Come on. This is fucking bullshit. Bullshit? <laughs> Threatening to molest your online buddies is bullshit. They're not my buddies. They're the only people you speak to. Okay, so we're going for a little drive. See the kids are still hanging out at the burger joints. Me and the guy, me and the guys, we'd go down to the diner after class every day. You know, get milkshakes, fries. Ew, please. You know you're really creeping me out. I'm trying to relate to you. No, 
You're trying to take me on some nostalgia trip. You're such a cliche. Oh, says the dope smoking, game playing, live at home world owes him a living millennial. I knew it. I knew it. The mask was gonna slip. The monster's been exposed. The hell are you talking about? <laughs> the real you. That bitter, vindictive old man. You pretend you're being a father, but you hate me, don't you? I don't hate you, Jim. How many times? I love you. Look, I'm sorry if I don't express that correctly. Okay, well, went the wrong way. Okay. We're here together. Because you're scared shitless of being alone? Oh, now you're an armchair psychologist. Just like the rest of the city. You brought me here, Michael. Don't get surprised when some of the razzle dazzle rubs come. Well, I thought you'd keep your head. You'll see through some of the bullshit. Maybe that's what I'm trying to do. If you think you're walking around a town full of idiots with your Midwestern <laughs> defense values, then you're probably the biggest idiot here. Wake up. Oh, what did I bring into this world? <laughs> you really have to meet my friend? Yeah. I really do. Then please don't get weird. For once in your life, don't be weird. Hell. There he is, the friendly neighborhood drug dealer. <coughs> Yo, oh, bro, man. What's, man? Up? What's, What's up, man? What's up, man? Good to see you. What are you turning tricks to pay for this shit, huh? Hey, who's the old man? It's my dad. Oh, all right, Mr. DeSanto. <laughs> Yeah, you the kid selling Jimmy pot by the pound? <laughs> nah, Jimmy, bro, your dad's funny, man. <laughs> Do this shit and let's get going. Oh, yeah, you, you got that other thing? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, man, what the fuck? Jimmy, just just hold on a second. Oh, all right, all right, later on. Careful with that. Hey, let's bounce. Bounce. We're bouncing now. That bouncing what now. Is that what we're doing? Bounce. All the, all the kids nowadays bounce. That's gonna be sort of really affect my driving now. Okay, your turn. Maybe when we get home. Yeah, I can see. Where now? <laughs> I'm starting to feel a little woozy. You're fine. No. See, I'm not glad I'm not driving at the minute. This is not normal. Out. You're just paranoid. This is not paranoia. This is totally justified concern. <laughs> you should see yourself. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. This is all wrong. Oh, this. I gotta stop. Oh, who's in there? It's harmless. Fetz has been using it for decades. What? You anesthetize me? You're fucking I'm protecting shit. you from yourself. Also, I took money from your bank account and I'm moving out. What? Right? You're too crazy, Dad. Come on. Jimmy! He's taking, taking the car and took money off him? Oh, ho. That's gonna be this is... what the hell is this? Still out of it? He's been taken up. Life is fucked at the moment, like family just doesn't give a shit. What do you want, Michael? Michael, Michael? I 
Just like surfing. <laughs> so I'm land and see. Yeah. So we lost everything. by the cops he'll be fucking arrested <laughs> it's gonna be a very slow walk Let's see if we can jog a bit is here, it's not too bad then. Hello I'm back Michael, I think you finally lost your mind. Your recent behavior and the company you've been keeping already had me very concerned. Now you've taken to attacking my Fabian, who was a close friend. And then Jimmy said you took drugs while driving him in your car. <laughs> well, we've decided to move out for a while. You promised me you'd change, and you haven't changed a bit. I know you say I always act like I'm in a movie. Well, this isn't that. I think I'm going to speak to a lawyer. I'm just really confused. Please, don't try to contact us and try not to get yourself killed. Amanda. Fuck. I'm sick. Well, this has been an interesting episode. It's not going very well for Michael. You're gonna, <laughs> you're gonna <have> available. <laughs> Alright, well, tell you what, well, um, I don't think there's much more else he can do at this point. Um, so we'll switch over to one of the other ones and do. No, yeah, channel that anger. We'll go to Frank, uh, Frank, uh, Trevor and the weekend drive to Franklin's. What the hell are you doing? And that, in a nutshell, is why trickle down economics is a load of shit. So he's gonna let him drown? Okay. I'm not sure what he was up to, but did we disturb you? <laughs> Brad's been dead. I think this is an FBI isn't it? still posing as Brad, trying to get information on Trevor. Pretty sure that's what it is. Who the fuck is this? The guy keeping you out of the gas chamber. Townley's on his way. We need to talk face to face. Warehouse off Dutch London and Banning. Oh, we can do more than talk, my friend. Yeah, I know. <laughs> okay.
Okay, so it looks like the Franklin mission will have to wait. No, I don't want to go. Oh my god. What is it? Why did that come up for? Oh my god. I don't know why that come up for. Why? Why are we back here again? Why? Uh, you gotta quit that shit, man. Yeah, I know. I take speed mostly. Look at me. Boom. Is that part of the mission to have to do this? Yeah. I can still take you, sugar tits. That's because you're fucking deranged. Not because you're in good shape. Hey, why don't you stick to doing fucking crunches and feeling bad about yourself, all right, pork chop? <laughs> pork chop? You know, I'm beginning to think that's exactly what you want to do. <laughs> so I take it that both of them have to do this. Okay then. You, you back there. I know you, but you, you I don't know. Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> It reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men that can't get erections. <laughs> hey, <laughs> Devin Weston is a very good friend of mine, so why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something, that guy gets more tail than, uh, <laughs> than a tail catcher. <laughs> I have to fucking remember that line. <laughs> you. <laughs> where did we meet? Nowhere, pal. Yeah, we did. Hey, oh, what are we doing here, huh? This. Please, keep the slick bastard the way from me. No, 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 Ferdinand, he's gone. He's gone. Uh -huh. It's okay, I've got some new friends here now. No, this okay. is Michael, and this, this is Trevor. No. Now our friend here, he claims he doesn't know I anything. Don't, I don't know anything. I don't know, I already told nothing, nothing. I don't know anything. Please, please, sir. You know about the Azerbaijanis? Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do mm. audiovisual, high fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price, VIP. You know? So, You're so. a fucking spy. <laughs> <laughs> and the asswipes at the agency know this. No. So I need to know. What did you tell them? And what did they tell you? I, I, hmm? told, I told them what I tell you. Uh huh. What? I. Hey. This whoa, 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 what is this? Just to see if you're lying or not. In Rockwood Hills, the man who owns it, he works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You two are gonna drive up to Rockford Hills, no. and when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. No, 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 Cause no, no, I'm tired of these fucking no, nitwits no, at the agency no. taking all the glory. No. All right, fuck is all this, huh? I got yeah. Good time, buddy. You know, go for a drive. Wait, wait. No, you get hmm. to work, and uh, I'm not here. Trevor, this is what Trevor knows to do. Caesar's place, Rockford Hills. We're gonna miss all the fun that Trevor's gonna have, or maybe we'll find out afterwards. <laughs> I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. So is he gonna be a problem? For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron mm. microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh, yeah. Everything will be out in the open. Everything will be under the microscope. Secrets, asshole. Me. Oh. after you put out your press release. Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. <laughs> anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. 
Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush, one of them spent ten years on the run, and the other led to the federal penitentiary, or, or, we stumbled on the cash depot job, Brad went down, you went down, Trevor got away, the FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. But maybe the better option, the least for Trevor. Right away, the second he saw you. You remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Townley. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Back then, sure. Not now. Interesting, Rockford Hills. Because we're at, you know, there's cars in front of me. This is a nice car, I don't want to wreck it too much. Okay. Let's go up and round. few weeks. No way that's your guy. Shit. Need anything? You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. Shouldn't have read a reality TV. House. This guy isn't our guy. Okay, okay, okay. Make sure you don't silence him just to make sure. If we're silencing someone, we're silencing the right someone. Get me another address. Cut. Hey, you want a coffee? Can I get you anything? Turns out that was the wrong Azerbaijani. We need a new address from Mr. K. Choose your instrument and go to work on it. Where do you start, eh, buddy? Uh, wait, what are you talking about, the wrong guy? No, who do you want? Just tell me what you want, huh, man? Ah, uh, please, look at me, please. Okay. I'm I hope you've been flossing. Are you still alive? No, 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 no! Hold on! way to make a man talk to stop him being able to talk. That hurt too much. Oh. <laughs> Mr. Phillips, ask him about Tahir Javan. What did you ask me? I know Tahir. I did his home theater. <laughs> he lives in Chumar. The right on the Western Highway. Well, that wasn't so tough, was it? Huh? <laughs> did you get that? Did you hear him? Lives in Chumash, the Western Highway. Chumash, you're driving. Remember, <laughs> terror does not take coffee breaks. Oh, we just did. <laughs> <laughs> We're probably going to go over the time this time, I think, wee bit, but sure. Last time or two was a wee bit, wee bit short, so it's all right. And then after this, I'll probably end up going live tonight. So, most times, uh, every other day, if I can do, you're mostly Wednesdays anyway. I'll be on Twitch. Seems like a productive relationship. You know, like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we're trying to take full advantage of them. Then what? This thing with the agency gets put to rest and we don't need you. Right. And what about Trevor? What about him? I need some resolution, Davey. You let him walk. You said... You'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job. No casualties. There were more eyes on that town than there needed to be. Yeah, well, according to my eyes, Trevor's your problem, Dave, as much as he is mine. Hey! He's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Okay. Has he said anything about... We will see. Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. 
We'll send another letter. It's about time anyway. Oh, so that's you who's been sending those fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad, who he thinks is locked up in high security and not, well, not six feet under in a grave marked Michael Town. The trainee's right. It's a good exercise. Yeah, the fuck. How'd that get started? A few years ago, a letter came... A letter came to the federal prison system addressed to Brad. It wasn't signed, but it gave a P.O. box in Sandy Shores. I played the part of Brad, and we started a correspondence. Yeah, thanks for telling me, Davey. I was <laughs> doing you a favor. Didn't think you'd want to know he was in the same state. Yeah, so now what? I just sit back and hope he doesn't figure it out? It's worked so far. He's a time bomb, Dave. And you mm. fucking know it. Storyline's getting interesting. It'd be interesting to see how this pans out. Find out who we're looking for. Yeah, we needed this. It'll probably not end well for Trevor. Like he's too he's too, you know loosen him up. No no loose, too much of a loose cannon. No, no, please. I said loose. I go for it. How many volts? You think they got running through these things? You're going to kill me! I will die! But you will kill me! My heart! I don't know if that's enough for him. Johnny, for God's sakes, look around. That enough for you? You're my eyes, Townley. What do you see? I see a couple guys that are way too old and too fat to be doing a political assassination. Let's keep it objective, okay? What's in the scope? When I need analysis, I'll call a pundit. There's a party, all right? We're live. You see anyone down there who might be an Azerbaijani? Fuck do I know? I'm there, maybe? You might be an Azerbaijan, uh -huh. for all I know. What's one look like? <laughs> they look eastern. Half this town looks eastern, Davey. You got the fall of the Shah and the collapse of communism to thank for that. Anyone stand out? No, they all kind of blend in. Make a call, Dave. We're gonna need some more info on this guy. They're having a party down there. That ain't gonna cut it, my friend. Shit, shit. I, let me think. I remember. Oh, Sorry, too no. late. Trevor, show our contestant what he's won today. I remember. Oh, okay. I remember. I remember. Give him his prize. It ain't even the biggest tool in the room. What? Oh, oh. Three. <laughs> Not. Oh, God. Jesus. Oh, I feel this, this is bad. Oh, God. Trevor loves it, like, but it's not. A bushy beard? Well, there was one guy there, but like. You know, I'm thinking maybe we uh, just take two bullets and put them in our Please, no. and just call an airstrike on Chumash Beach. I need eyes on that party. Pick up the scope and give me a report. Who am I looking for? Steve saying beard. What do you got? 
Anything specific or is just one, two, three. Let's start at Mountain Men and we'll work our way down until someone fits the profile. Now well, there's a few beards at this party. Vinewood's full of weak chins. Place is famous for it. Damn. Beards are in fashion in Chumash. Land of beach hipsters. We need more. It's gonna be a long day until you give us some intel on our targets. Oh, he, he's, he's, he's got beard. He smokes. He smokes like a fucking chimney. I don't know. Trev, maybe one more time? Just to be sure. No, please, no. Uh -huh. I told you, he smokes. That's all I know. So I'm gonna do burn that uh, fucking. Do the right thing, Phillips. It hurts. Not again. Don't think anymore. Why? No. <laughs> Root! They just keep going down! It feels like you ripped my jaw out! No, uh, uh, oh, you look so peaceful sleeping there! I don't want to wake him! It's coming! Gremlin, he would have passed away there. Let me go do it! <laughs> Poor guy. Smoke cigarettes, Mr. K says. He smokes like a pack of two a day. Redwood cigarettes? Thank you, Mr. K. Steve's telling me he chain smokes redwoods. It ain't the cigarettes that'll kill him. It's the guys who put the warnings on the packets you should worry about. And he's left-handed. Oh, now I get it. You're telling me to assassinate a guy because he's got facial hair, a cigarette, and he's left-handed. I'm telling you to assassinate a guy because he's a threat to national security. The rest, details. No, oh, he's not him. He's right-handed. He smokes, though. Ah, I see someone. He fits the profile. Yep. Fits it all the way. Fits it all the way. That was the guy. I had a feeling. It'll check out. Well, we've got him. It's done. Woo! That is a wrap, my friends. Hopefully. Excellent work, the pair of you. Now I got a racquetball uh, game to get uh, to. So, Trevor, if you take care of Mr. K, I think we're all set. What the <laughs> fuck do you want me to do with him? I would say he's outlived his usefulness. Oh. 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 That's a sport. Wait a second, Mitsu. Fuck, let's just go, okay? I ain't gonna let those G-Man fucking scumbags tell me what to do. Oh, what? You just tortured me. Don't ask too many fucking questions. Let's go. Get up. Come on, up the fucking stairs. Come let him go. God, he's in terrible shape. God love him. That's not what you want in December, is it? He's gonna get him out of there. Well, at least he's Trevor. He's 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 about to have a bit of an asshole, but his heart's in the right place. How's your mouth? It hurts. Can you speak? Kind of. Are you gonna hold it together? I want to go home. I want to see my family. No, 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 no. You have no home. You have no family. That shit is over. I do. They're in the morning wood. I love them very much. No. That's your old life. That's over now. You're off the grid. You're one of the invisible people. Just take me home! I'm taking you to the airport. You're gonna get on a plane. 
You're flying a long way from this country and you're gonna spread your message. I don't have a message! You're a torture advocate! Advocate? The media and the government would have us believe that torture is some necessary thing. We need it to get information, to assert ourselves. Did we get any information out of you? I would have told you everything! Exactly! Tortures for the torturer, or the guy giving the order to the torturer. You torture for the good times! We should all admit that! It's useless as a means of getting information! I'm really lightheaded. Sometimes you torture for the torturee, but only if they're prepared to pay. I am very unwell. It's me, 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 me with you. Jesus Christ, good grief. I thought we really bonded, but now I'm happy. Let's get my t-shirt. You can't just walk into the airport like this. Oh, sick. We reported to the police, surely. I see he gives him his t-shirt and he just drives off. in here all right and look trust no one all right you're alone now really yeah really now let's go fuck off come on this god knows i wonder if we'll ever see him again Poor guy. <laughs> Alright, let me see. We could probably name it. Well, let's, uh, let's see. We're roughly at that time now, I think. I I wonder if we need to be Franklin for that one. That was, um, God love that guy, <laughs> Jesus. That was cruel. You see. It's not too far away at least. Head home. See what his mission is, and then. White vans will be a bit ominous, parked right outside. Now, don't you step foot in this yard. Why is half my house? Now, I'm a call the police. For what? Disloyalty, boy. Disloyalty? What is you talking about? Don't act like you don't know what it is, homeboy. Yo, you ain't been to the set, ain't came to none of the meetings. Mm, hanging out with old man, ignoring your homies, acting all superior. Your mama would turn over in her grave, boy. Mm -hmm. So you giving me a lecture mm -hmm. for being a good enough gang bang. Gangs is positive. That's all we got, my nigga. That's our heritage. Ain't nothing positive about your crazy ass. Man, where's Tanisha at? She got more sense than to hang out with your sorry ass. You know you always been like this, boy. I say left, you say right. I say become a doctor. You say become a patient. I say... Who is that? Hello, Missy. Wow, Franklin. You never told me that you had a sister. I'm Denise, Franklin's housemate. And aunt, my mother's old dried up ass. Shut sister. the fuck up! Now shut the fuck up! Here, darling. Why don't you go get yourself 
something nice. Okay. <laughs> $7. I said something nice, not expensive. You want to be a greedy fucking cow? Huh? No. Now get the fuck out of here, all right? You men are all the same. Man, what the fuck you doing here? Here with the boy. The boys. What? I'm fucking new in town. I'm making friends, all right? Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dawg. What fucking thing? I love things. I'm the king of things. I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something about the thing, okay? What thing? I'm talking about the little stretch thing, man. Fucking beautiful. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. Oh, come Who on, is man. This fool, man. What is man, just come on. What? Where's this? Thing happening down Grove Street. Grove Street. <laughs> Spraying some motherfuckers. I can drive by with the best of us. Behave yourself, man. No more. What's happening? What you in stress set up? We buying weight, homie. Something that'll move us up the food chain, nigga. For real. Not this real in this town, nigga. Particularly where you and stress concerned. Man, this is an investment opportunity. You got to speculate to accumulate. Ooh, first rule of business. Hey, since we're out here banging. Either you got some dust. Fool wanna get butt naked? <laughs> I'll get whatever it takes me, old boy. Homie's crazy, man. <laughs> so I've heard. Grove Street, look at this. Some good times up here in the previous ones. Talking. <laughs> 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 My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Well, let's go. How about a taste? No, man, we leaving. I want a taste of the other side of the brick. Now you heard what your boy said. You're leaving. Hey, give me, give me the, give me the back. Whoa. What the fuck? Did we ask for a key or a fucking ounce? Man, that's motherfucking drywall. Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here. Mm -hmm. Can't fucking hustle a hustler. Say, so, say so he knew that himself. It's like he was just piercing into a small bag of it. Fight out in Grove Street.
In the ass, in the ass. They get a bit of health here. It's getting. Are you not dead yet? Keep just run, just get out of here. Let's get out of here. This way. Okay. Damn, it's stinking this motherfucker. Shit ain't no river, man. It's a motherfucker sewer. Then we're in the right place. Yeah. Oh, shit. Fuck's sake. Don't lose him. Ah, come on. Oh, come on. Fuck's sake. Yeah, well, I got beat, so I couldn't fucking do much. I'll try this one. We'll get this one done. And then... Right above me. Got the shooter, but the uh, pilot is still alive. 
We'll just want to make sure we stay in sight. Here, up here. Let's see if we can still arrive and get going. Oh, it's a fancy looking car. I don't know, we just have to get out of here ourselves now. Right? This isn't gonna go well. This helicopter is doing the heading. Peter Franklin's sitting there thinking, well, I think Trevor's getting the worst of it. Fucking load. Trevor's crazy, but we hope we have already known this. So he'll get out of this. One last cop. helicopter
Come on, to get rid of this chopper. More chance. This chopper's gone. Not close to blown up by now. <laughs> I think this car is near enough had it. The rim is off one of the tires. Okay. We tell them exactly where we are. down the road and get another car. <laughs> Take whatever's going. This is our Trevor thing. stuff. Oh, okay. the heist it's a good idea for us to meet at the condo so maybe we should tell floyd it is a good idea to meet at the condo it's a great idea and tell him we need chips and dip and prostitutes <laughs> Well, that was interesting. Um, so the heist is now ready to go, it looks like. So that could be the next mission, the next one. Good stuff, but uh, we'll leave it there for now. So thanks very much for watching. Like, subscribe if you haven't done so already. Check out me on Twitch every week. Um, hopefully just uh, mostly on Wednesday nights, but um, I have a Discord channel there as well because you can get um, three, tw excuse me, three Twitch. Um, and you can follow me there. Jump, jump into the Discord chat, and uh, keep an eye on what we're doing. So, until then, have a good one. <laughs>